The data slicer in Populi lets you build reports about your students. These reports can be simple or pretty complicated. If you've never worked with data queries before, even building a simple report might seem really daunting. But if you get just a few basic concepts under your belt, you can dig into a wealth of information about your students, like enrollment, programs, demographics, and a whole lot more. This series is going to go in depth to get you comfortable building these reports. Let's take a look. Here's what we're going to cover. First, what you can do with the data slicer, the levels of questions you can ask of your data. And second, and versus or joins, the basic concept that allows you to ask these questions. Level 1. Ask a question of data on student profiles. Which students are enrolled in at least one course in the fall term? Level 2. Ask questions of multiple bits of data on student profiles. Which students are enrolled in at least one course in the fall term with an entrance term of the previous fall. Also, notice that in this example, we're asking for both of those pieces of data to be true about all results. That's different than what we'll see in the next level. Level three. It lets you ask questions of multiple fields on student profiles, allowing for at least one condition to be true for all results. Which students are enrolled in one course in the fall term or one course in the spring term? Level 4. It lets you ask questions of multiple fields on student profiles, requiring that some conditions be true for all results, and that at least one out of multiple conditions be true for all results. Which students are in the undergraduate program and enrolled in one course in the fall term, and have an entrance term of either fall or spring? In a subsequent video, we'll cover how to actually create conditions at these various levels, but right now, we want to focus on the hinge concept that allows you to ask those various levels of the questions above. At level one, a single condition looking at a single bit of data on a profile. It's obvious that this condition has to be true of all results. If we ask, which students show an enrollment in at least one course in the fall term, all students on the list of results will have an enrollment in at least one course in the fall term. However, as soon as you add another condition into that question, you have to choose between whether you're asking for both conditions to be true or only one of the conditions to be true. You make that choice by using two different kinds of joins between the conditions, and versus or. And joins say that this and that need to be true. Or joins say this or that need to be true. Using the AND join, you could say, show me all students enrolled in fall and spring terms, and all the results would have an enrollment in both terms. You could also use the OR join and say, show me all students enrolled in the fall or the spring term, which would show you students enrolled only in the fall term, only in the spring term, as well as students enrolled in both terms. Once you have your head around those joins, you're able to create focused reports that will answer your questions with a high degree of specificity. Again, we'll be covering how to do this in a later video, so keep an eye out. If you have further questions, visit support.populiweb.com.